Hello, welcome back. Um, I'll go through Werewolf, the Apocalypse screens that I have, um, and we'll go through that series next. So here is Werewolf, the Apocalypse, first edition storyteller screen. It's kind of this sandy, dirty, just rust color. It's three panels with uh, character generation and combat on the opposite side. So Storyteller can't actually see the combat table. But yeah, that's how that's laid out. Goes through all the steps of character generation similar to the second edition Vampire Storyteller screen. And here is the combat chart. Maneuvers table, rank gifts, first rank gift chart. So in the inside, at the top real quick, it kind of goes through the different stages and the bonuses related to that. But delirium chart, oh. Let's do it this way. Health levels, battle, difficulty numbers, difficulties, degrees of success, renown, our middle table has some maneuvers, uh, cover difficulty and terrain types. Not sure, it's not really focusing that well. Uh, firearms initiative difficulties in a weapons chart along with the outlay of uh, of combat right here and this panel gauntlet stepping sideways frenzy Strength feats and a huge section on jumping, fire, and falling. This one came with a character pad. So here's a thick pad of character sheets, front and back. Werewolf character sheet and I can do this without it peeling off. There is the back side of it. Description. Some additional stuff there for you. And a short sort of combat chart for you. Combat in the Umbra. It's basically front and back. But this is just a chart going through combat which again is one of the hardest parts of the storyteller system managing all this stuff and has a helpful chart which you probably won't be able to read because the paper is very thin but yeah that chart that's on the outside is is there um yeah so that's the first edition screen we'll look at the second edition screen in a second thank